Party Scarlets gave a warm welcome to their unbeaten team. The Scarlets going for six wins from six in an all Welsh clash against the Dragons. Fresh off a fantastic win against Munster, Scarlets continued the excitement going wide in the early stages and ten minutes in they were 7-0 up when James Davis scored the first try which Alan Thomas converted. Flanker Davis was clearly in the mood to entertain, gathering an up and under, he set off putting in motion what must come to be considered one of the tries of the season. The Scarlets channeled the All Blacks as they produced offload after offload to keep the Dragons guessing in defence, and despite a high tackle they continued their charge to the line. Finally, a ruck was formed a few metres from the line, and prop Phil John offered himself on the crash ball to scar the Scarlets' second try. So 12-0 after 20 minutes, but the Dragons did get some points with a Jason Toby penalty soon after. The Dragons dug in and waited for their moment to strike back, which arrived when Davis tried one offload too many. Toby pounced and did well to regather his own kick and score the visitors' first try. But the conversion was missed and Scarlets went in at half-time 12-8 ahead. Alad Thomas opened up the seven-point gap again after 48 minutes, but only 10 minutes later, the game's turning point arrived. Dragons winger Adam Hughes was sent to the sin bin, and Scarlets wasted no time in putting points on the board. They went for the try from the resulting penalty, and using their extra man, trundled their way towards the line. By the time Phil John had touched down for his second of the match, most of the Scarlets' team was helping shove him over the line. Thomas missed the conversion, but Scarlets had a healthy 20 points to 8 lead. On the 65th minute, and still with that man advantage, Scarlets did almost exactly the same thing, this time with a different try scorer, James Davis getting his second and Scarlets' bonus point try. A bit of controversy in the scoring of it, though, with Dragons lock Matthew Screech getting a nasty-looking boot to the face, but after consultation with the TMO, the referee said the try stood. With 10 minutes of the game left, the best the Dragons could hope for was a losing bonus point. They took the game to Scarlets in the closing stages and got a second try after 72 minutes. Sarel Pretorius nipping over from a ruck close to the line. Despite the conversion, they couldn't close the gap to less than seven points and it finished 25-15. Scarlets' impressive run at the top of the Guinness Pro 12 continues.